hello and welcome back to my channel fabulous ideas and I'm just going to be getting straight on with it this is the room that I'm going to be showing you it's actually not a room it's just like an alcove into my living room it's a dead space at the moment um, harboring a lot of junk in there and I am going to be transforming this yes into a brand new office and um, yeah we have a little bit of everything a little bit of my cat bed a little bit of scratch post there suitcase and a chest of drawers and that box that you see in front of me has got some special to do with this office and um, we'll talk a bit about that later but yes I have to rehome all of this stuff here and um, convert this little place here into an office this package that I said was important actually has some relevance to this video because this is going to be my chair this is going to be my new office chair um, for the office that I'm going to be creating and I, it's, um, it's, you have to assemble this yourself. I actually got this from Amazon and I can put the link down in that description box below if you are interested because it's not just an ordinary office chair. Well, I don't think so anyway. So I can't wait to show you what's inside this box. So let's open the box. I am so excited to show you what this chair looks like. Um, I was, um, you know, I don't really look for office chairs. So I was really surprised when I saw this one because the kind of image that I have for this office, this was a perfect um, chair for the office that I am creating with all of the color matches as well. So nicely wrapped by Amazon, very protected in this um, all this um, jiffy wrap and cardboard wrap so I'm just going to be taking all of the pieces out and we'll lay all down with the instructions and then I will start putting this back together Okay, so as you can see from the instructions, the instructions number one is we need to attach the wheels onto the legs and also put in the pump and that's the part that's going to move the chair up and down. So as you can see down here, I have the wheels and they look like this. Here is the pump that you can see and this is just the legs, the base part. Okay, so I'm just going to be popping these in the slots here. So let's do that. There we go, that's number one. I have to give it quite a big bit of a push, but they all go in. Okay, so now that we've got that with the wheels, then I have to put the pump in and that just goes in like this. Oh, actually, that really works, yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go on to instruction number two. And as you can see here, number two is quite um, a big step actually because we're going to be putting the lever at the bottom of the chair that needs to go in we also need to be doing the arms and putting the base of the chair with the um, backrest as well so a few things there let me just unwrap everything so that we can go on to number two you can see the color you can see what it's going to be looking like I'm already establishing that the arms look like this and these two um, screws will go into the side here and also I've put all my screws on the floor so that I don't get confused and I have to be putting the lever part um, on the bottom and they've put the little holes in there of the chair and I'll do that at the end so the first thing I'm going to be doing is putting the arms in and I have these screws here to do that um, followed by these as well 
so and you do not need any screwdriver for this it's actually all done by the allen key so that's great so i don't need any tools it's provided for me so let's get on with the putting in the arms you can see that I have put on the armrests and then I'm going to just attach the back which is this and we're just going to be placing it here you can see where it goes because they've held in place so that would be a lot easier and it would just look something like that so on the sides here if we just have a look and zoom you in Um, you can see where the holes are right there and that's where the other screws will go so I'm going to put two on that side and two on the other side and that will hold the backrest in place So the, all of it's done, the satisfying part is doing the end where I just place it into the gas pump and finally I can actually sit down and test it. So yes, let's just check that I've done this right, perfect. Um, where is the lever? On the other side. So let's try and see if this pump action is working. So very sturdy i like the tilt it's got some tilt action here so very comfortable and it goes up and down and if i turn to the side you can see and let's go down just so that you can see it there we go lovely I hope that you like it. It's a lovely um, baby pink colour, but it goes with my room at the moment and my decor. So that's exactly what I wanted to achieve. And I'm really, really am happy with it. Um, as you can see, the legs, it has a good swivel, um, as you saw. So, yeah, so the end of the day, <laughs> I do have that issue with that corner and rearranging some of my furniture, but um, we will go through that process. Um, at the moment, up in my room, I do have a wardrobe, and I'm not using it as a wardrobe, I'm actually using it as a linen um, wall cupboard. Um, that's what I'm doing at the moment. I've put some shelves in there. Um, but what I'm going to be doing is because the chest of drawers in the corner at the moment doesn't have anything in, I will then transfer all the linen into the chest of drawers and unfortunately we'll have to um, give up the wardrobe. Um, but that will be going into my room. The cat bed will be just relocated somewhere else in this room. And the scratch post, I'm sure I can find a place for that. So the suitcase will just be packed away. 
the cat toys will go somewhere like I said somewhere else in the room and hopefully that would clear that little corner over there um, and um, yes and then we're going to be needing a desk so um, I will show you on um, Amazon the kind of desk that I have ordered um, and again I'll put the link down below um, in the description box if you're interested in that desk um, it can be used for multiple purposes as well not just a desk um, but obviously for in my case I'm going to be using it as a office desk so yes yeah, so we will start with um, you know dismantling the wardrobe upstairs removing the linen from there and then transferring the large chest of drawers which is over here this large chest of drawers will become my new linen um, cupboard and um, yeah so that's that and then I'll probably put some nice little decoration things on top just to make it look pretty in my room and um, we'll do that next and yeah that will clear up the space here um, which will allow for the desk the desk is on order um, and it will be coming soon so this will still be in this video but um, it's going to be on a different day so I'll see you in the next clip where we will be removing this chest of drawers and um, clearing out the wardrobe in my room so see you in a while okay so while i'm here i just want to show you the the wardrobe that i was telling you about that is used as a linen drawer it's got nothing in at the moment just took a shelf out but yes it looks like this and it was just a wardrobe that i got from ikea so yes yeah, so the chest of drawers is now going to be here I've done my measurements so it will fit so I'm just going to dismantle this ready to leave and then I will be getting that chest of drawers from downstairs and then I'll bring it up and I'll be placing it here so that's the next stage so here is that empty space I just need to get my chest of drawers so that was a hard job I'm doing all that wardrobe and I'm just going to be placing it here as you can see the chest of drawers is now taken from downstairs and it is now up in my room so you know I'm quite happy with that it just needs a bit of dressing up with some fancy things <laughs> Okay, so I have cleared that area now and um, I've just given it a good sweep and a mop and everything. So I've had a delivery today and I'm sure it is the mat that I'm going to put down on this area. Um, so I'm going to be opening that and showing you what mat that I got. So I got it from Amazon. Um, so yeah, let's get that open. So I'm so excited to be showing you what's in here. Um, let's slice it from the top. Okay. Open there to get that out. Oh, there it is. Okay. I'm hoping that I did my measurements correct. Um, it isn't perfect but I did it smaller rather than larger so as you can see it is a nice baby pink it is actually the same pink I tried to match it up as good as I could as the chair so um, yeah let's get so this is the carpet um, lovely and textured so let's see how this looks in here okay so I think that's going to look great it's always hard with carpet to um, get your corners just make sure they bend down but um, overall it will look like that and that's where the desk will go so 
subtle pink there okay and another exciting thing has happened as well my desk has been delivered so i can't wait to get that out of the box and assemble that and put it in the okay so in the box was this jiffy bag um it's all wrapped up in jiffy and it's also um protected with this um, paper as well so i'm gonna have to all unwrap all of this just to get to the box Okay, so I've just got everything down on the floor. Everything's now completely opened. I have a set of instructions in front of me. I'm seeing that they do supply an Allen key, so I don't think there is going to be too much. I mean, if that is just the set of instructions on this one piece of paper, then it's basically just putting on the legs. We don't need any screwdriver. Everything is in this little box here. Um, so that's really great. So, you know, if you are interested in a desk like this, then I'll put the links down below because if you're not good at DIY, I am. So um, I don't really have a problem putting things together. But if you don't like putting things together, this is quite a very simple desk. It comes in three pieces and all you'll need to do is put the legs on with no screwdriver at all. Just an Allen key which is provided for you. So let's see. Okay, so... I have all of the screws here, so I'm sure there's three. Nope, there's one, two, three. I think they give you a spare one because they're... Okay, so there is the desk. I like the fact that it is actually 120 centimeters in length, so it's wide. I like the fact that it isn't too, um, you know, the, the width isn't that long because I don't want a big massive table taking up that room in that little corner, but it long enough to fit some things and laptop. So that's what I will be using this for. So I think it's perfect. So I'm gonna put it in the corner now and we'll see what it looks like in there. Okay, so as you can see, the desk is in and it's handy as well in this corner that I actually have two plug sockets. So that's going to be great for a lamp and the laptop um, to be charging. can even get myself an extension if and I don't think I will actually need that. But um, yeah, that's perfect. Um, and I love, like I said, I love the length of it. I love that it's got that length. Um, if possible, I might, I don't know if I can fit any drawers in there just to keep I don't know we'll see how much space you know you can get very slim units we will see um, as you know I've got the pink chair um, I've put that away at the moment that's been done up and just waited I didn't realize the desk would come that quick on delivery I was expecting it um, in another two weeks because that's what they said but I was pleasantly surprised they delivered that early so yeah so um, that's how it's looking at the moment um, I have got some accessories as well that I do want to show you so I will show you those and we can talk about those as well. So I hope that you all enjoyed the products in this video. Um, I'm not going to be showing the accessories, I'm going to do that in another video because I have quite a few accessories um, that is going to be going into the office. So I'll do that in another video. Um, I hope that you don't miss that and um, you take a look at that. Um, so yeah, I check that description box down below. So um, it's got all the prices and all of the product details. 
Um, I do hope that you enjoyed this video. If you haven't subscribed, then please don't forget to do so. Give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you all again in another video for more fabulous ideas. Take care and be safe.